Short Me Tina here from shortmetina.com doing a quick follow-up recap to ticker G-E-R-N right now. What you're looking at is a daily chart dating back to around 2017. But I want to focus in on price action that occurred, let's say, the last uh, six or seven trading days. I did a video a couple of days ago. Definitely go to shortmetina.com or go to my YouTube page, shortmetina, and find that video. I think it was like, uh, I don't know the exact date. It was like September 19, 20th, somewhere around there. At any rate, I indicated that I think the stock, right, may have placed in a double bottom, right, on September um 13 we went we went as low as 510 the following day we went as low as 512 and i said to myself or i said to the viewers i think the stock put in a double bottom five that five to 510 area might be the low and it may have been a good time to go long and i said you know what the following few days the stock didn't really do much it kind of sold off a little bit and i said well this is this is where new traders tend to go wrong right when stocks sell off as opposed to looking at it as an opportunity to actually buy at a lower price they kind of like look for the next high flyer that's not what you want to do you want to be in a stock once it pulls back remains dormant so you can actually catch that move up and if you did that you'd be sitting pretty pretty you'd, you'd be sitting pretty pretty i don't know you'd be doing pretty well right now um, because the stock is sitting here at 620. So I'm going to wrap it up. Still very bullish on ticker GER and we're not in this trade. I'm not sure why. I do know why. We're over allocated in my opinion in terms of speculative picks and I think this is a speculative pick. Um, but I think that the stock can do good things. Sitting here at 620, I think my initial price target is around $8. So you still have about $2 worth of upside. So if you're looking for a trade, Definitely pay attention to ticker G E R N and don't forget about and don't forget about ticker G L W. I've been talking about this stock for I want to say the last month or two. So put this on your watch list, please. It's moving. It's leaving the train without you. When I first talked about this stock, it was a, it was at a wrap. It was at why can't I talk today? I don't know. It was at thirty dollars. Right now we're sitting at thirty five sixty nine most recent high was around 36 so if you so if you've ignored me this entire time you've missed about six dollars per share of upside that's a lot and i don't think the party stops here at 36. in fact right the stock in my opinion is consolidating for that next move up as i've stated before my initial price target it's a bit of a range i see the stock kind of like settling at around um let's say 40 to 50 dollars so there's still about 10 rather five my math is correct five to fifteen dollars worth of upside per share here so put glw on your watch list beautiful pattern emerging rounding bottom gap up consolidation gap up and it's consolidating in my opinion for that next gap so that's kind of it short me tina here once again from shortmetina.com if you enjoyed any part of these video recaps do two things for me one head on over to my youtube page at short me tina hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications i do videos every single day ensure not to miss any then head on over to shortmetina.com sign up become a member thank you for listening and as always thank you.